Well, um, here's an ingredients question. Now they come up uh, quite a lot, but this one's slightly trickier, the second part, than, than many. Um, let's start with the first part anyway, just fairly standard. So here are the ingredients need to make 12 shortcakes. So we have to have these ingredients exact to make up our shortcakes. Liz makes some shortcakes and she uses 25 milliliters of milk. So how many did she make all together? So we've got to look at how many times the 25 mils could make um, what's required for 12. We only need 10 for 12, so if we do 25 divided by 10, that tells us she can make 2.5 times as many cakes. So we've got to do 2.5, I'll put that down here if you like, 2.5 times 12. There's a number of ways you can do this, but without a calculator, let's say, well, it's 12, 12, and a half of 12, which is 6. All right, so that's 1 times 12, 1 times 12, and this is a half of 12. And that's my two and a half, so that comes to 30. So she can make 30 cakes. And that will get us two marks. Now, next um, bit of information, we've got these ingredients for Robert. He's got a 500, a 1,000, butter, 1,000 flour, 500 sugar, 500 milk. Work out the greatest number of shortcakes Robert can make. Now, you'll be limited here by um, these ingredients. So we've got to look at each ingredient and see what we can get. And then the answer will be the lowest of any we, we get, because we might be able to make more, say, with butter than with sugar, but we need butter and sugar um, in the food. So I'll, I'll proceed and hopefully you'll understand. Well, with 500 grams of sugar, we could make 10 times as much, so that was, we could make 120, but remember, we've got to have enough of the other stuff. With 1,000 grams of butter, that's five times as much butter, because we had 200. So 512 is 60. So we're now down to 60 going to be exactly the same for flour and then when we come to um, the 500 milliliters of milk well I could work it out but it's going to be 50 divided by 10 um, which will give me 50 lots of 12 I mean it is 600 but you could have kind of ignored that because you're going to be limited by the lack of butter and flour and they limit you to um, five times as much as what you had before so you could make five times 12 I like that a bit higher five times 12 and so that's you could make 60 shortcakes. Remember, you have to have the right proportions of ingredients. Although you could make more, you've got enough sugar to do more and enough milk to do more, you were limited by the amount of butter and flour that you had to 60 shortcakes. I hope that's clear.